Now, you you also mentioned that you you know you told me earlier that you've been cut off. People cut you off or something of that sort. Yeah. What did you do to get cut off? I'm trying to ask the same thing. It's like what happened. Cut to off by who? Is it is it females? Is it the the sixties? What's going on? Uh, ain't gonna it, the 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 rap industry as a whole, not a whole, but my my industry friends that I thought was my friends now, free YSL, Gunna Slime, y'all did you know what I'm saying you you already know we ain't even got to talk long are, are way. We, are we speaking Dirt. like a? Are we speaking like a Pee Wee Long Way? Nah, no, 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 no. Long Way is my boy. He's still we doing our thing and all that. You know what I'm saying? Dirt. It's the other niggas. Just, just, just look. And I ain't gonna say nothing because I'm not trying to piss too many off with the cutoff word because they, oh, you need your hand out and all that. It's like, don't bang my street if you ain't gonna fuck with me. Cause now any nigga, you can name some names. And if you don't see me with them while they in LA and all that, nigga, you know they supposed to be with me, nigga. That's who we talking about. It's plain as day. You get what I'm saying? Like, nigga, you niggas, when you niggas was broke, we could go through DMs, or when you niggas was up and coming, we could do that. I just feel like they wanted to be around me when they was broke because they didn't have nothing. But because they got this in my head, in their head that I just rob rappers and do all that. I don't rob rappers. Like, nigga, name one. Name, name one. Nigga, I be making sure you niggas is cool. Like, nigga, on the set, I ain't never closed in and took nothing. Nigga made gave me something, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, some cat. I don't take jury from niggas. Like, nigga, you have never seen me on Instagram my like, oh yeah, come get it back. Woo, 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 woo. I don't do that shit, nigga. You know what I'm saying? So you you know what type of pressure this shit is, though. You know this the real one. You done been with a nigga while we was in the trenches. So now you a millionaire now. You don't want that type of pressure around. But you think I'ma turn that energy on you? You my boy. I love you. I wouldn't give a fuck if you had a dollar or a billion. Nigga, I'ma treat you the same way. So I mean, now me saying that, you can say some names, and I'ma tell you, do you see me around or not? It's a few, it's, it's a few <laughs> names, but you said you said that they they they're repping your shit. So their neighborhood, you you put them in. Are are they sixties now? I mean, I don't do the recruiting and all that. I ain't no game boss, so I don't know. But you know what I'm saying? You niggas ain't coming down to the section once we did with the checking in. If you ain't making us feel like we love you, then shit, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, no. Nigga, you not from the set. So any nigga banging the set that ain't touching down and ain't doing their thing and all that, or I didn't, didn't need me, like, me and Quavo got into it over that shit. And he, like, 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 he didn't understand and like we cool like we super cool but it's like uh I, like like me and quavo got into some shit and uh when bobby smarter came home but i didn't know he signed him and that was me jumping to the conclusion but still it's like nigga when bobby came home that's my boy nigga, baby you and them fuck with cuz like nigga i don't got nothing against bobby that's my dog i fuck with rebel bobby i fuck with the gs9 all the brooklyn quickly niggas you know what i'm saying i fuck around you know what I'm saying? So, uh, Bobby came home and he gave cuz a bag and all that shit. Cuz the nigga in the trenches, my niggas gave me a bag and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? But the nigga in the trenches, cuz I didn't stood. I'm the one that ended your beef with Chief Keith and them. Niggas don't want to, niggas don't want to, nigga, shine the light on that. That day that they took that picture at the studio, that was me and Kid Ink session, nigga. Oh, uh, look, nigga, nigga, Chief Keith for Kid Ink, I just met for the first time for real in person that day, but nigga, they came up there tweaking, poles out and all that, won't smoke. Nigga, you niggas wasn't even piped up like that, like, not like that, I'm not even trying to talk like that. My other young nigga, uh, bands, cuz be activated, we go bands and all that shit, but... Long story short, I bounce out like, nigga, nigga, put them guns up. Nigga, ain't none of that going on right here. Nigga, nigga, y'all bust a shot in the city. Y'all niggas ain't gonna make it up out this motherfucker. Plain blank, period. Fredo was there. That's my dog. Rest in peace. So he made it a little bit smoother because, you know, some niggas be young-minded. Yeah. So some, yeah, Fredo, my dog. Rest in peace, right? But 
Other niggas is young minded, high headed. You know what I'm saying? Chief Keefe and them having money. Nigga don't want to hear it. You hear me? And they really on that. You know what I'm saying? So he made it smoother because that's big cuz they big cuz oh. You know what I'm saying? He made it smoother to, to, to smooth the shit out. And nigga, we talked about all that. We hashed the shit out. But mind you, if they wanted to just start smoking at me, they know they could have killed me because they had more than one gun. You get what I'm saying? On the hood. So my whole thing is this.